Hello everybody and welcome back to Dickie's videos where no war game remains unplayed. Further ado, here we are again with the hype that is Field of Glory 2 Medieval. And of course, as I've been playing on King difficulty and trying to really hurt myself metaphorically online against a computer player, we've gone for something I discussed earlier on a couple of videos ago when I was looking at the English and French armies. Um, I'm going to go all night for the French. And I really wanted to do this, but we're only going to click that like and subscribe button uh, to enjoy more uh, further content on Field of Glory 2 Medieval. So we're going to look at playing French and... Re oh god, this is probably the worst map to go all cavalry. But you know what? I've said it. It is how the cookie crumbles. Ready up, you French nobles. Mount your cavalry. Uh, we're going to have as much cavalry as I possibly can. Oh no, we're not having any foot troops. Can I actually go all cavalry? Uh... Yes, 21 points. Can we get some javelin? Light javelin? No. 21 points. What could we get for 21? It's peasants. We don't care. So, ready the French knights. Charge forward in victory or death. Unfortunately, it does select as two units of light units, but we'll accept that. Oh my god, this is by far the worst ever, ever map to do this. But, you know what? If, if it be, it be. Uh, we've got mounted crossbowmen that need to be in the front uh, arc here. Uh, and the sergeant's there. To oh, God. <laughs> this is going to be painful. We're going to have to hook right into this clear. This rough terrain is going to be a bugger. Um, but that's the way it is. Uh, oh, we've got two commanders. Yeah, two generals. That's, that's particularly, particularly a good thing to do. Oh, we've got too many generals, too many French nobles, too many lonely hearts in the world. Okay, you're in that kind of command group. You will be in his command group. I mean, if we wanted to, we could dismount, but that will really break up with what I want to do here. So, we're going to try it, and this is for when you get the game, to see if this actually works, because it could go horribly wrong. What are we? We're still... Highly... Oh, God. <laughs> it's got a battle wagon! A battle wagon. And lots of medium troops and crossbowmen. Okay. I think we, the only thing we can do is just belt forwards. He's just belt for, Oh my god, he's got lots of dismounted knights. Oh my, we're going to get smashed. The battle wagon! We're, of course, playing the German Imperials. A solid list I've seen so far for the Germans. I need to actually get over to this left side as quickly as possible. So remember, we are playing, of course, on King difficulty here. Um, I think we may be able to just get over this rough terrain. Maybe this left side won't be so good, but... Um, Uh, we've got to decide which way we want to go here. Oh, the dismounted knights are a bit of all right. Sergeants are there. <laughs> We're going to get trapped between some woods and some rough terrain. <laughs> it's going to be a pain train. As long as I can do crazy stuff against his cavalry, it'll be fine. And these medium troops here will get absolutely troused in the open against Gary. Oh, here come the crossbowmen. It's the zones of control how they fall on this left side. We've got to get over this rough terrain. That bow wagon is so slow. Um, it only has nine AP points. Uh, it's something we'll look at in a, in a future video, of course. Um, but can we charge? Oh, yes, let's get the bloody hell out of there. To victory or death. Um, oh, God. Let's charge them here. See if that... Oh, no, it doesn't. I've made a made an issue here, guys. Impact's amazing there. I'm going to go for glory. Let's 
And of course we have this little bit of a dingbat on the left on the right side. Okay. Pretty good impact though for them lancers. The uh, enemy medium foot will, uh, of course, this left side's got raw crossbowmen actually. If we break this left side, we can push around to this right side. There's a lot of medium foot there. As long as we're in combat, he can't shoot us. God, 9 AP. 300 strength, though. Here's the evade. Oh, for a second I thought there was a capture there. Stop shooting at me. Oh... <laughs> What's a bit of naughtiness? Okay, charge away, lads. For Philippe, this is where the it, this is going to hurt us. Uh, we've just got to make sure we can pull ahead here. So what we do? Turn and shoot. What is the difference there? Oh, yeah, there you go. Bro, this is all I want to do is... Unfortunately, his, um, his turning circle has changed here. Oh, we're going to get absolutely mauled here. Oh, two units of cavalry just ruptured already. Oh, fragmented. <laughs> I peaked so high. I peaked. We're going to have to try and drop that. But, terrain is random for a reason. Oh, we decided to charge there. Battle wagon. I love how it's got dismounted, uh, dismounted knights, or I think it's dismounted armored spearmen, or oh, defensive spearmen, but armored though as well. Oh, this is going to be bad. Eight percent per unit. Oh, a double drop. Oh, a clash of shields. But you take the win with a loss. I think, unfortunately, not being able to uh, what space out, we're in trouble here a little bit. Is that a... F no, it's not a flank. God, we're getting our asses kicked here, lads. Takes a lot of our AP points, that does. Ugh. Gonna try this. Yeah, right, we're gonna charge them. I'm surprised he hasn't got all of his units in combat, so. Oh, this is gonna go bad. This is gonna go bad. I think if we don't at least disrupt them on the impact, we're at a massive loss. And them dismounted knights and sergeants are evil. It's bogged down. Bogged down here. Oh, cavalry lined up on the left, some sergeants. 
I wonder where the abbreviation sergeant comes from. Why are they called sergeants rather than just an arbor knight? Oh god, here's the auto brake. Oh. This. <laughs> We've only been playing for 10 minutes. I think I've lost it already. <laughs> wow. So we've realised, in certain situations, this army is going to get absolutely hankered to death. I think if I had maybe knights to the left, the crossbowmen wouldn't have st stood as long as they did. All these dismounted lancers look angry. Oh, finally we got five points. Huzzah! A slight breakthrough there. That POA difference is huge when you get that officer in there. But of course, remember, the King difficulty does ramp it up a little bit here. Actually, we're just going to stay here just in case he doesn't move, because then we can flank him twice. By somehow... We beat this. No, we're not. We'll get absolutely mauled. Oh wow, the uh, the combat modifiers there must have been huge against us. And also, the standard wagon is just going to block us. Oh, we're, we're going to auto break there. Oh, we actually did flank with some cavalry in the rear. I'm quite impressed. These are getting worn down a little bit due to combat losses. A rally. We found honour in the field. Okay, let's walk away before we get shot to bits. Oh, it's ridiculous this thing is. Well, we've got to. We're going to get whooped. Uh, we're going to get whooped on our own terms. We should really put the general into that other unit here, because it's going to get bogged down here. Here's the break, 35. Like did an advanced mounted crossbowman section to come around the rear. And we do get some honor back by destroying that unit on the right. Another rally. Come on, rally up again. Oh, they're in some trouble. Still trying to break them down from destruction. Uh, we can't put actually put the general in there. I, don't, I think he must have died. Did he die? Well, eventually we're going to get ground down here. Ugh. Ugh. Well, we're going to drop either way here. Nope. Our next turn. They're stuck. And he's got units still in, in reserve, really. Oh, insult for injury. He charges in the lad area. Yeah, the impact is probably what we're going to win, but the unit's that big, that armoured, and the POAs are that high that it's just 
a lot of pain there for us. Oh, the computer's that brave, he charges his crossbowman in there. Oh, we rallied up. Brilliant. Now it's going to get charged by Cosbroman in the rear. Wow, what's that? 15 minutes. 15 minutes, and that included setup. <laughs> so, we're realising in some situation, all night armies aren't particularly good. You see, it's just the if I don't break them, at least on the impact it's going to be a bad thing. So I think if you're playing a human opponent, maybe it would be slightly more even, but as I'm playing on King, um, it's it's bad news all around. So the French nobles splatter across the four winds. Defeat has been taken. Click that like, click that subscribe button. Come back for more. Who can beat the king? And bye-bye.